This is my only find for about two hours, apart from a button. Uh, hang on, spin you around. Uh, hopefully you can see that. I can make out a bust on there, facing right. So I think it's in Edward the seventh. We just don't. Nah, I don't know if it looks like him or not. There's Britannia on the back. I know that much. There you go. I just can't make out who that is. I'll clean it up at home. Ninety-seven. I think we've got a um, cartwheel penny or a big Georgian penny. Anyway, that's a right munch fest going on here behind me. Yeah, I think so. Well, at least I'm finding something at the moment. I've just spent a couple of hours finding absolutely nothing. And uh, that's quite tedious, even though it's a lovely day and I have these ponies for company. That might not be it. That might not be a Georgian penny. Hang on, let me give that a rub up. Mm, no, not a Georgian penny, I lied. I've just given it a bit of a rub with my brush. I think I can make out a shield on the front there, and it's a lot thicker than a penny. I don't think it's a coin at all. I'll have to clean that up at home. At, clean that up at home, rather. Yeah, I don't know. Strange. Uh, this is what it sounded like. Just move my phone out of the way. Give me an 87. Yeah, hopefully you can see that there. I think that is a little glint of silver. And there's a milled edge, it looks quite thin. Ooh, exciting. Hang on. <laughs> Hopefully this is something other than a George V. No offence George, but sick of finding George V silvers. Well, not sick of it, always enjoy it. Oh yes. Focus camera, George III. Yes, happy days. A bit worn. But the silver's nice. A little sixpence. Backside's not too bad. 1816. That's what I'm here for. It's been a long slog this afternoon. Really hot. Barely any signals. It's really dry. So that's cheered me right up. Yes. <laughs> found already this morning so I'm back the next day I'm in sensitive mode full tones three inches down. Let's have a look. Uh, here we are. Looks like two of them stuck together. Probably half pennies. Are they coins? Oh, maybe they're melted together. They don't seem to want to come apart. 
<laughs> yeah, I can't make out much on that. And I think they have been melted together, which makes sense. There's a forge that used to be here. Yeah, I'll, I'll clean them up at home. I'm trying to find out what's going on there. It's been really quiet. I mean, it's a beautiful day, very hot, and the area is fantastic. But I want to find something, so I'm gonna I'm gonna move around, see if I can find another area. Hopefully, I'll see you again. Right, well, that worked. I walked a few steps on this other field that I've done before, and I've got a little uh, thrippity bit. It's only a brass thrippity bit, but it's a good sign. Spin you around. Yeah, here we go. Actually, it's only Queen Elizabeth. But I'm, I've done this area, so if I can find a few things here, that would be good, because there's a footpath just over there. So hopefully there's a few bits of silver, you never know. Just walking back to the car over the field I've already done. I've got a nice 81 signal. I'll spin you around. All right, sounded like this. Oh, I might have hit it with my spade. It's only a penny just as well, really. But yeah, I, I was doing this bit yesterday. <laughs> so I know I've gone over it. It's a Vicky. And apart from me hitting it, it's a welcome visitor. Because it's dried up a little bit today. That's why I was walking home. So that's probably my last hole. I'll see you in a sec. Alright, thanks for watching if you've watched this far. A bit quiet on the second half, but the George the third sixpence made up for it in the first half, I think. So a bit of sunburn, nice walk around in a beautiful, beautiful area. And uh, yeah, I'll see you next week. If you liked it, give us a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. See you later.